The information that you're going to see in this video, video is very startling. Could it be that we're looking at two sides of the same coin? Joe Biden's showing us one side of the coin. Trump is showing us the other side of the coin. The Biden campaign and the Trump campaign have always, in my opinion, been campaigning for the enemy, and they've been putting it in front of our faces. And um, one of the things that we looked at was the 3033 number. And so here it is again. He, he's in Minnesota, 30330. And you'll see this on, on the podium for all the things that he was doing. But when I caught this picture, look what it says the battle for the soul of the nation. All the stuff for, for Joe Biden's campaign, for his advertisements, all the time on the podium, it's 30330 and the battle for your soul. So, so where, where does that take all of us? Is it, is it just Joe Biden? I said, well, what, what, what's going on with Trump? Let's take a look at the other side. And I don't want anyone thinking that I'm just, you know, going after the Democrats or, or Biden. It has nothing to do with that. So I'm going to take a look at the other side. Let, let's look at what, what's going on with Trump. Well, let me show you something. I was talking to our dear brother, Ed, from our Sword of God Discord, and he asked to help out in any way that he could. So I asked him to take a look at, at Trump and, and what's going on on his side of the campaign. And so I was doing some research, and, and Ed was doing a lot of research. And this is, this is some of the notes that Ed just sent me the other day. And what did Ed find out? That Trump uses the MAGA acronym. And it's a campaign slogan that Trump says was his idea. Donald Trump claims to have made up the slogan, Make America Great Again. He claims to make it himself and uses the acronym MAGA. In an interview in Washington, Mr. Mr. Trump recounted how he landed upon the, the famous uh, catchphrase that he claimed he thought of himself. And he said that he originally thought of, we will make America great, then make America great, and then finally make America great again, popped into his brain, he says. So he got some of his attorneys together and, and he told them to see if they can register it as a trademark. So now it's a registered trademark. But what else is it? What else is it? MAGA, is the highest degree in the church of Satan. The acronym MAGA is the highest degree in the church of Satan. The church of Satan is a religious organization dedicated to Satanism and is codified in the Satanic Bible. The Satan, Satanic church was established as, at the Black House in San Francisco in April of 1966. In 2001, the church's headquarters was moved to Hell's Kitchen in New York City. What happened in 2001? Didn't we have one of the world's greatest catastrophes in New York in 2001? September 11th, 2001. And then what? The sa satanic church moved to New York right around that same time frame? Understand, this acronym MAGA is also not a mistake. It's not a coincidence. Could it be that we're looking at two sides of the same coin? Joe Biden's showing us one side of the coin. Trump is showing us the other side of the coin. MAGA is the highest degree in the satanic church. It's the fifth degree. It's the highest degree. There's five degrees. And MAGA, or MAGUS, is the fifth and the highest degree. It says the members of the priesthood are people of accomplishment in the real world. They are movers and shakers. And they keep their affiliation and their rank a secret. And Ed has many, many more finds that he has. Many websites to show this acronym MAGA is directly connected with Trump and his campaign and directly connected to 
the church of Satan. Even Trump says he found the magic wand. What magic wand is he talking about? And Trump says that the MAGA acronym also stands for what? Microsoft, Apple, Google, and Amazon. M-A-G-A, -A, MAGA, Microsoft, Apple, Google, and Amazon. Don't we all have learned in the last couple of years and, and, and so more in the last year, we're finding out that Microsoft, Apple, Google, and Amazon are behind some of the satanic things going on around the world. And MAGA also is an acronym for that. Brothers and sisters, I just, I just want to show you that this is all not happening in a vacuum. The Biden campaign and the Trump campaign have always, in my opinion, been campaigning for the enemy and they've been putting it in front of our faces. There it is, MAGA. MAGA is all over everything. Make America great. That's his slogan. Wherever you go, it's make America great. MAGA is on everything. See, MAGA, make America great. And what do we have? I found this on another website. The hierarchy of the church of Satan. There it is. Ed found the exact same thing I found. The fifth degree, the highest degree. The administrator, the agent, the grotto master. The highest rank in the church of Satan. And so when we look at this, I want everyone to know that in no way am I just saying it's the Democrats or the Republicans. I don't do political videos. I'm just trying to show everyone that what we're watching on the world stage is the enemy advancing. These are all troublous times. We're all watching this happen in front of our faces. It's unfolding. And the enemy puts it in front of our face, but they hide it. And I just showed you some of the ways in which they hide it. So with that being said, let's, let's go on to the greater part of our teachings today.